Today let's talk about the buoyancy of warm air, or simply that warm air rises. We have encountered this phenomenon countless times before. We intuitively understand that warm air rises, hot air balloons stay up in the air, but it's a problem inside of a building, or to simplify it, inside of a large box. If you have a large box or a building and you heat up the air inside of it, that air will naturally whoop, rise to the top. And when it rises to the top, it actually creates more air pressure at the top and creates less air pressure at the bottom. Which means that the inside air, just by nature of being heated to be comfortable for you and I, is pushing itself out the top of your building and actually pulling air into the bottom of the building. That is called the stack effect, because it creates a stack of pressure in the whole building. So that becomes especially problematic in the residential space where there's a lot of ceiling penetrations generally. Plumbing penetrations, mechanical penetrations, electrical, pot lights, chimneys, etc. There's a lot of holes in our standard ceiling planes, which means that there's a lot of potential for airflow and all of the problems that come with it, particularly accelerated by this pesky stack effect. Yet again, get your ceiling right, you're gonna be just fine. 